John and I met while commuting on Metro North Commuter Railroad. I walked in the door of uh, the 524 train and I saw Susan, very attractive, um, and there was no place to sit though. When I saw him, you know, glancing at me from across the train, I thought he was being rather bold, but I was enjoying every minute of it. I would come bursting through the door with my hair flying and my coat flying and trying to make this train so I could see this beautiful woman again. Every evening I would see him and I wouldn't always have seats next to me, but when I did, he never sat next to me. He would always kind of go back to his area and sort of face me from afar. I didn't feel comfortable going up and speaking with her because she was, there were people there, and so I couldn't make my move. I, I think the problem was I didn't have a move. This went on for almost two full months. I parked my car in different stations to try to figure out where she would get off. And whenever I did that, of course, she was never on the train. It was a Friday evening, and I had changed my plans. I was going to stay in the city and decided to go home instead. Got on my normal train a little bit early. The train was empty, and I turned, went through the door, and went to my normal spot, and lo and behold, John was sitting there. So I figured this is my chance to finally meet him. Went up to him, asked if I could join him. He got up and let me in to sit down, and uh, I finally reached over, and I said, Hi, my name is Susan. We shook hands and I said, it's nice to finally meet you. We didn't know about common interests or anything, but she just, there was a vibe, there was a feeling, there was a comfort, and we, we chatted with one another very easily. I don't know if I believe in fate, but I do think it was meant to be. And since John had a very short amount of time that he commuted, I, I was really fortunate to even meet him at all. I never felt I would find love on a train. You just never know if you keep your eyes and ears open and you're friendly and if uh, you smile, you never know. The connection you make might last for the next 60 or 70 years.